What? 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 Oh. Scout, it's Pauling. Tell me you got the briefcase. Yeah, sure. And nobody saw you. Uh, basically nobody. Scout, I'm here right now. Oh, well, that's a funny story. Hello, Miss Pauling. We killed everybody and took a briefcase. Not everybody, soldier. You left seven witnesses, guys. Uh, uh, Six. Look, just keep the briefcase safe, okay? Have a good weekend, guys. Goodbye, Miss Pauling. I am leaving the van now. Bye-bye. Okay, then. Hey, hey, uh, Miss Pauling, before you go, uh... Uh-huh. Uh... Uh... Scout, uh, let's uh, say something. Uh, you, you're probably real busy this weekend, right? Funny you should mention that. Um, looks like I will be burying bodies all weekend so that you don't go to jail. Oh, good, good. So, we're both busy. Gotta go. A lot of people busy with busyness. Asking out that dial tone again, I see. Go to hell, spy. <laughs> hey, look at all this. What are you two eggheads been working on? Nice catch. Yeah, listen, uh, we've been running some experiments on the teleporter. Well, yeah, y'all ought to take a look at this. Wow, you can teleport bread. That is big news. Uh, is the demo back with the beer yet? Cause I- oh! What the hell is that? Tumors! Y'all know what this means, right? Ah! We cannot teleport bread anymore! Whoa, whoa, not exactly, soldier. You teleport as much bread as you like. That goes for all of you. If there's something any of y'all wanted to do before you, well, died, now would be a good time. How long before these tumors kill us? Well, let's see. We all use the teleporter, let's say, six times a day, times four years, minus we not bread. Hmm. Three days. Yes, we all have three days to live. a bucket. Dear God. There's more. No. It contains the dying wish of every man here. Scout, you did collect everyone's dying wish. Uh, you bet. Excellent. Gentlemen, synchronize your death watches. We have 70 hours to live. For most men, no time at all. We are not most men. We are mercenaries. We have the resources, the will, to make these hours count. The clock is ticking, gentlemen. Let's begin. Our first dying wish is Scouts. He's drawn a picture of me getting hit by a car. I have something radiating off of me. Yeah, those are stink lines. That's why the car hit him, because he smells. Yes, I see. Here you've drawn me having sexual congress with the Eiffel Tower. <laughs> Eiffel Tower having sexual congress with me. <laughs> Both of us relaxing post-coitus. <laughs> I'm crying and the Eiffel Tower has stink lines coming off of it. Did anyone besides Scout put a card into the bucket? Oh, man. Classic Scout. Fantastic. This was a huge waste of my time. You did not read mine! Does it say you want the bucket? Yes! See you all in hell. Go away. Hey, uh, you got a second? Oh, Scout, please go f yourself. Yeah, <laughs> that's, that's, that's funny. Um, anyway, I- oh, oh, Wait, 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 oh, Come on, spy, I'm wedging my head through a door here to tell you I'm sorry. Oh. Make it quick. So, I, I did 
write down a last wish. I'd, uh, I'd like to go on a date with Miss Pauling. You? You're terrible with girls. What? No, 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 Spy, look, look at this. And this, and this here. Spy, look at all of this. <laughs> no, I am great with girls. We both got buckets of chicken. You want to do it? Eh, uh, okay. But you, Spy, you are amazing with ladies. You know, classy ones, the kind that smell good and, and can read and always have their glasses on, just kind of crooked, you know? Ones that don't go for a guy like me. Hmm. And why is that, do you think? Come on, Spy, I don't know. Well, a mystery we will take to our graves then. Goodbye. Wait, wait, I... Okay, look, fine. Spy, this never leaves this room. You are better than me, all right? I need your help. I'll do it on one condition. Say that again. <clears throat> Seduce me. You. Seduce me. What? Spy, I ain't gonna say- Seduce me! Right. Right. Okay. Okay. Hey there, good looking. I got a bucket of chicken. I'm not one of your fried chicken tramps. I'm a woman. I like my men dangerous, mysterious. You want to be my lover? Earn it. Seduce me! Final question. You have a dinner date for seven. What time do you arrive? Seven. A.M. Case the restaurant, run background checks on the staff. Can the cook be trusted? If not, I gotta kill him. Dispose of the body, replace him with my own guy no later than 4.30. You're ready. Really? No. Everything you just said was insane. And we are out of time. Congratulations. You're a failure. Oh. I failed, did I? Yes. Did I? Yes. Did I? Scout, where is this going? Where it's going is, I don't need you. I'll put this date on myself. Yourself. That's right, fancy pants, myself. So why don't you take your little failure, roll it up sideways, and... Okay, crap, I gotta go. Screw you, though. Surprise! Took the briefcase. Don't worry. We can fix this. We'll get it back, and the administrator never has to know. You look. You look. Ah. Uh... Drunk. Wrong. Soft. No. Wrong. Blurry. Ravishing. Uh huh. You too. Hmm. Hold on. That's the briefcase right there. Scout, you. Are you having a problem? Yeah, no, yeah, uh, well, that, yeah, the thing is... Guys, hey, fellas, listen, it's just bread that gets tumors. Not even tumors. It's some form of self-aware beauty mark that only metastasizes in an environment of pure wheat. Here, watch this. 
Oh, look, he hates me so much. <laughs> so we're fine, as long as nobody teleports any bread. Question, what's your question, soldier? I teleported bread. What? You told me to. How much? I have done nothing but teleport bread for three days. There, there, have you been sending it? Scout, I get one day off, a year, and you just wasted it on this. Goodbye. Wait, 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 wait. Uh, why don't we discuss it over dinner? What the hell is that? Pretty well. Now go. Hey, Miss Polly. Oh, I am so sorry. Cuts, Cal, what for? Pressing the one button you're never supposed to press? Do you have any idea what's in a briefcase that. Oh, oh, give me your watch. Yeah, exactly. See, yeah, that is where this all starts. No, actually, we're. Uh, we're... Ah, no! <laughs> I teleported! Story, which is that I like you, and you should probably be sitting for the. Guys! Close the blast door! Well, Miss Paul, look, my last few hours, I just. Oh, hey! I can't feel anything below my neck. Oh, God. Oh, now I can feel it. Ow. Ow. Oh, Ow. God, I'm, I'm so sorry. This is, this is not That the... was so much fun. You're not mad? I was furious. Oh, my God, you set off the briefcase alarm, and you were having a prom for some reason. But then there was a monster, and we shot it, and I built a bomb, and I think my leg's broken. Can we do this again? Yeah, sure. Oh, wait, nah, we can't. I'm, I'm gonna be dead. Wait, what? Good news! We're not dying! We are going to live forever! I didn't say that! I just said we're not filled with tumors! Oh, thank God. <laughs> so yeah, Miss Pauline, I guess it's a date. Actually, this is my only day off this year. Oh. Oh, but you could ride along with me on some jobs. Tomorrow, I'm belt sanding the fingerprints off a pile of corpses. Eh, no. Oh, you could help me yank the molars out of a box full of heads. Noted it. Okay, uh, well, Friday I've got to kill somebody who pressed a briefcase alarm button and... Oh, uh, you're already gonna be at that one. <laughs>